G'day Tezio. I've got three interesting videos here for you. All been sent in by subscribers or followers of my page. Thank you very much. Very much appreciated. And this one, I know it's not anything to do with trucking, but I just find it very funny myself. This one is actually on my Facebook page, so if you want to have a look, go to my Facebook page, it's Tez the Trucky. I'm not totally sure where this is taken from. I'm guessing it's the UK somewhere by the accents. I would love to know. I'm guessing it's one of these um, incidents where the customer is always right, even though everyone's probably tried to tell him not to, but just went to her head and tried to teach him a lesson. I do love the noise when you can hear the bulker bag going on top of this car. It's beautiful. He's lined up. No. Oh. 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 Did you hear that? Oh my. I think no. By the looks, that forklift driver is a pretty good one. Um, getting a half a bulker bag, or if I hold about half a ton, not scratching the side of the car, and managed to put it centre on top of the vehicle. And beautifully just crushing the top of the car there just by the look of the forklift driver you can just tell it goes i told you so but mate and there you go you can strap it in just as as it is this next one comes from dash cam adelaide off his facebook page if you're quick you might have to go back but there's a van just gone past that uh, rigid truck curtain side now you got this little car Slipping up past that uh, curtain side. Next thing, he's cut right across. Very gutsy move. Now he's back in front of the semi, probably slipped through on his blind spot and absolutely taken off. Happened in Adelaide somewhere, of all places. Quite a few have sent this one to me uh, by Facebook or YouTube with links. Thank you. And some of you have asked my take on it as well. So I'm going to run through this video a couple of times so we can get a better idea what my viewers on it this is actually from Arana Enterprises YouTube channel and they're a logging company down in Tassie it wasn't a icy morning so there was no black ice on the road but it was the first rain for about a month apparently this is my guess I can't really tell because there's a little bit of water on the windscreen just in the important part but my guess is that he must have dropped the truck onto the side of the road there when he started the slide uh, probably overreacted, overcorrected when you come back on the road and that's when he's just got it sideways. So once he started to get all out of shape, he was just there for the ride. Uh, don't know what he had on board. Um, don't know the conditions of his vehicle or his tyres or his brakes. Once he started to get that truck all out of shape, uh, it would have been virtually impossible to get it straight again, especially the speed he was probably traveling because apparently that's a pretty fast downhill run being a very wet and slippery conditions it, it would have been virtually impossible to pull it straight and any of us who've uh, dragged single trailers in the past or road trains once that trailer gets out of shape and starts pushing you you're just there for the ride can everyone please be safe on the roads keep the shiny side up and i will catch you on the flip side bye